So you know how in Joseph Smith's 1835 First Vision account, he sees two unnamed personages, presumably angels? Well, here, let me give you the rundown. So in his journal, it's in the entry labeled November 9th through the 11th. So he goes into the Silent Grove, and after praying, a personage appeared. And then another personage soon appeared. And this second personage testifies that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. And then he also says that he sees many angels in this vision, saying that he was about 14 years old when this happened. But then right after this sentence, technically it's the same very long sentence, he says, when I was about 17 years old, I saw another vision of angels. So just in this journal entry alone, it really sounds like he only sees angels and not God in Christ. Okay, but here's the thing I wanted to bring up. If you turn a few pages in his journal to November 14th, he has this to say. So a man comes into town by the name of Erastus Holmes. And then Erastus is like, hey, Joseph, how did you start this church? To which Joseph responds by saying this. I commenced and gave him a brief relation of my experience while in my juvenile years, say from six years old up to the time I received the first visitation of angels, which was when I was about 14 years old, and also the visitations that I received afterward concerning the Book of Mormon. So yeah, I feel like it's safe to say that at least by 1835, that Joseph fully intended those two personages to in fact be angels.